Hello. Good evening. Let's get back into Elder Scrolls. Had my dinner with gelato. Clean eating. I'm slightly better than before. So I was feeling a bit off earlier, but I think I'm feeling a little bit better now. Maybe I've got all the bloody plastic dust in my bloody nose. This is a way shot. Me. God, one of these fucking things.
Here we go. Are you sure? Oh, I can probably hear my dishwasher draining. Firestone. Well, your morrow comes wrong. Or well, why they're here at least. That's the um. Storms. Maybe there won't be five stones so far.
Visions, they're still coming in. Spider jumping from the ceiling, which is good. Not the delve, cool. Just gonna go straight down the middle.
There's next boxes. Ah, fucking passion. Fucking passion. Months. Is actually not too low, not in the right area. There's a way shower in again. There. Mark it when I get my cups. Yep. Checking out in the open. Side, I think it was the same as a control for I like that back top. I want to get back top side.
Leave the damn team more. Spawn already. Yep, there was no second exit right there. Getting recipes. Right, that reminds me. Why is Sean Rex in that way? I think. There it is. Another print done. It's a little scary. So for D and D, I'm printing off some monster tokens. Just for when, um, until I have all the miniatures for the monsters I need. So I'll just use the tokens instead. Now, I've gotten two versions and I'm not sure which one I like best. So you got on the left, oh, sorry, on the right, you've got the skull. Then on the left, you got like a little cute demon thing. Now, I kind of like the skull better, but I printed off a bunch of the yellow one. 
but I don't dislike it, I just don't know if I like it more. Excuse me. Alright, I'm going to take a photo and post this to some friends. Give me a second. I'm going to end up going with a skull. Okay, interesting. Either they're not a hostile faction yet, but they will be. Or I'm missing something. Let's go back to the way shot.
cool, 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 cool. No doubt, no doubt, no doubt. Just ignore me. Shit. Oh, it's worm cult. Here as well. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. No, I'm gonna be stuck, am I? God damn it. Try that again. What I get for trying to avoid a confrontation, I end up stuck. And it's a bell, so I gotta do shit while I'm here. Uh... Oh, that's not freaky at all. Double beds. The green looks awfully like a leak. I went the wrong way. Maybe that was the exit. Oh, it's so many assassins. In the sink in a magical world, also be mostly priests and mages, but a lot of assassins apparently. A lot of assassins. Whereas the Dark Brotherhood's a bit of a cult and they've got a, they're all assassins essentially. A couple of mages. Don't judge.
hopefully this is the boss. Not am Grimora, the ex Alvi or something like that. I don't remember what they called. I thought I had one more. Oh wait, no, that was the one more. Okay, so now that I've done that, let's do these. Oh, I was in with four, maybe. Where do you tell us come from? Tread here. I was brave. I have grown tired of fighting this thirst. Though it shames me, I can no longer feed off. I merely cling to what's left of who I was. I may end before. Lingering shame on my an end to this curse once and for all. I may be at the mercy of Molag Bal, but I will slake my thirst on his servants until my voice is heard. And if they deliver me to Cold Harbor for eternal torment. There's something in your eyes that tells me you are speaking more than kind words. I've forgotten the feeling of hope, but I don't need it. The ones who created me. I met him before. Nice with Scar Shaw. It does. I'm going to send this to one more person. I lied, there's two more people, but still. Hey, dinosaur lizard thingy, majiggy. 
kill a croc, but to raise fire. I think last time there was three rounds, but that's all there was only two. This must be the boss. He's fucking scary. Obisius. Obicus. Where the hell is that guy shot? There's a further way down. There's the sky star. Oh, now I can leave.
And I'm just going backwards. Across on top of it. Oh. And I think there's a way shine you buy. Let's get to the way shine. Hard rock. This is an hard rock. Ah, because it's Vardenfell. Right. That's funny. So cute, though. Oh, um, where am I going? Sorry, the island. How's that going? Looks like the Daedra certainly put you through your paces. How did you fare? Do you have the stones I asked for? So you're a scholar as well. I certainly wouldn't have predicted that. Before the tribunal showed up, we Dunmer worshipped the Daedra. They raised no small... Nothing until they rest side by side. If a mage manages to wake all seven... Of course not. Why should I? Good. My dear Lane chooses her allies well. I must call on a particularly shrewd Remora named Zykanaz. 
He refuses all summons, so we'll have to use less pleasant means of negotiation. Surely an adventurer of your stature isn't frightened of a single Dremora. No, but it's just stupid. Dremora is no more dangerous than taming bears. And even the dull-witted orcs can do that. I hope you'll keep those... The ritual allows me to speak to you through the veil. So keep your mind open when you reach the other side. Or as open as you can manage. Mormolag Kanashanta Del Norgandra Abagayanye. It's done. Trounce that unruly Dramora, and the reward I promised is yours. I hear the rattling of chains. You've arrived. Strike down the Dragonars, then hurry back to the portal. Your soul is forfeit, Summoner. Oh, I could go on. Actually, no, they do. Harbor. Well done. Hmm. I envy your youth. I might have found some way to rob or deceive a weakened benefactor, but not you. It's just on to the next adventure. Vibrance and integrity. What a curious combination. Spare me your incredulity, Outlander. Not a word I told you was a lie. I simply didn't care to divulge all that I could have. Truly, it's baffling you didn't suspect this from the start. Why else summon a Daedra if not to make a bargain? I truly fail to see how it is any of your concern, but I suppose you have done me a favor. To put it simply, I need more time. I don't do this out of vanity. An ancient threat looms at the edge of my sight. I must remain until... That would be your opinion, wouldn't it? Probably the bag of her she's seen. Summoning immediately. Lane, be ready. Zygonaz, Duke of Black Covenant, appear. By the seven stones of your Dark Prince, you will parley with me. Silence, Daedra. Bend and heed my words. I demand immortality. Uh. Name your price. Yes, price. There is no gift without cost, which I will grant your wish. But know this, you will live in endless fear. For on the day of my master's choosing, I will come in the guise of a mortal man. I know what you're thinking. I'm not exactly pleased either, but Mr. Stropper insisted this was real. You need to understand. It's a danger that is long to come.
Your actions have in You've served me well. <laughs> Ask me. Hey. I believe it was the last one that we recently got. Yep. Someone, please help! Please help. Bandits, they attacked my father's wagon on the roads to Suron. They're stealing everything we own. My father's a proud mur. They... Keep your weapons sheathed, citizen. The situation is well in hand, I assure you. <laughs> Bandits, I commend you for springing to this mayor's defense, but you should be cautious. I'm investigating some irregularities in Suran's justice system. I fear the town's lead constable, Marshal Hularan, may be arresting people without cause. Hmm. You did answer the call of a citizen in peril. Very well. I need evidence, testimony. Many of the Marshal's prisoners are toiling on plantations outside Suran. Talk to them. Gather some proof of Halaran's corruption. Then meet me at Ula's Manor. Plantations are crawling with ironhound mercenaries. I'll draw them away as best I can, but do hurry. They won't leave their posts for long. Ah, you must be a recent arrival. I am called the Scarlet Judge, vanquisher. Of no, my oath is of a personal nature. I revere the three, but my relationship with the rulers of Vardenfell is um, complex. Ordinators are bound by restrictive temple law. I've been called savior and menace. Hero and villain. If you'd call me a vigilante, then so be it. My only concern is the lives and wealth of cold-hearted mercenaries. Swords for hire without virtue or scruple. They serve the plantation owners, and I suspect Marshal Hlar. Other than the fact that she's in charge of the constabulary? This is a Redoran city. House Redoran demands certainty in all things. Hlaren's deputies won't sanction an arrest. Good morning, how are you? Overwhelming evidence. We have no proof, only suspicion. Well, technically it's evening for me, but how are you? Ah, they're probably gone. Heck, them keep missing. Was missing the message because I was messing around with the printer. Yes, precisely. House Redoran does not suffer this kind of misconduct lightly. Once we prove Florence's crimes, the house will turn against her. Okay.
Stay your last slaver. I work. Whipping me will not motivate me further. Can I? Yes. Will I? No. Not until Overseer Torvain is dead. He's already spotted you, I know it. If he finds out I've spoken to you, I'm as good as dead. You think? Stand, slave! Another lazy slave, I'll kill you too! Mm, there you killed them. I can't stand because you killed them. He's fucking mad. Join my other rebellious slaves. Die. Slavery is illegal in this part of Arwen, so what the fuck do you think you're doing? down overseer Torvain. Well fought, friend. If ever an elf had it coming, it was Torvain. I was taking a deposit to the bank. A week's worth of coin, fairly earned. Marshal Hlaren accosted me and seized it. Accused me of stealing from some farmer outside town. <laughs> the farmer's dead, of course, but who needs witnesses when an orc's to blame? Sounds like... I sound like an American cop. Maybe. These damn dark elves think I'm nothing but an animal. Some don't even think I can speak. Makes them careless around me. Mistress Dren's been shouting about the quality of her laborers. You might find something of value in her manner. Well, I'll be a skeever's drunk auntie. Did you really cut down Overseer Torvain? Yep. Certainly won't miss that horse's arse. Falsely? Hmm. Guess that's a matter of perspective. I punched a dark elf. But I promise you, that wormy little snowback had it coming. I... Well, maybe that someone was Master Arano. And maybe the punch broke his jaw in three places. But that's what he gets for asking me to service his guards. Laren told me I can shorten my... Sure's blood. I knew that elf was skeeving me up. Did you just... A prisoner? Slave, more like... Where I don't belong here. That Marshal Hilarin. She says I murdered a beggar the day I arrived in Surin. Master Karak's building a new prison in Suron, but it isn't finished yet. In the meantime, they make us work out here in the fields. Hilarin visits Karak.
to carry too deep. Alright. I got lucky. I don't know why, why that sucked at them. Got lucky. I probably doesn't even sound good. Got a corrupt judge. What a shock. That's not suspicious at all. Thanks for the dude that's in the cat.
He's gonna be dead, and I'm gonna get framed, I reckon. I know. Ah, true to your word. I knew I could trust you. I see my faith in you was not misplaced. We will discuss your evidence and more, but uh, not in this hall. You. My mentor used her wealth to better others, not herself. This evidence proves Lauren's guilt, but there's no telling how deep the corruption goes. There's only one person I trust with. My observations of Lauren suggest paranoia bordering on obsession. If she suspects that anyone is moving against her, she'll no doubt summon her iron hounds. If a melee... If Constable Gretgar's going to arrest the Marshal without a fight, we'll have to distract her mercenaries. I'll deal with the constables. You raid the Iron Hound camp in the Daedric ruins outside Suran. Bit of a Batman, this dude. I'm Batman. See you before.
No one leaves until we clean up this mess. And dark elves, Norse, Not and you too. This is ridiculous. I'm if sorry, Talimna. You there! You've been selected for a random search! Come. Follow me quietly, away from the gates. We have a judge in common. Yeah. This'll do. Just keep your voice down. Sorry about this cloak and dagger nonsense. Oh, good. I can't be seen talking to anyone even remotely suspicious. She's on the lookout for anyone who might be colluding with the Scarlet Judge. I'm a friend of House Redoran, but that'll only get you so far in this town. Especially with him. There was an ambush. Somehow Marshal Hlaren found out the Scarlet Judge was coming. Must have been one of the plantation owners. Damn their eyes! I... I wasn't fast enough. Hlaren needs him to recant his accusations. Publicly. Probably got one of her hounds working him over right now, trying to squeeze out a confession. I'd let you into the prison myself, but Halaren doesn't trust me with the keys. I've got the respect of her constables and the house, but my hands aren't dirty enough for her. You're going to have to find the key. Hmm. Constable Kren will snatch up a bribe without batting an eye. If you're short on coin... Try convincing Surin's locksmith, Remas, to cut you a deal. Oh, the judge and I go way back. The two of us, along with the former marshal, kept this town safe for... Ha! Is that what we're calling him now? It wasn't too long ago slavery was legal in Morrowind. Buying and selling people was legal right here in Sura. That sound right to you? The judge keeps us honest... Who's known me for years? Not a proper mage, they say. Rubbish! By Vec, if I get my hands on that fetcher from Summit, just watching my business fall into ruin. People used to rely on me to heal their children and mend their injuries, but now it's all Menel Dinian this and Menel Dinian that. Damned guild lackey. He's even pinning up. The Cretans saying I'm not a mage, but I am. I just happen to love alchemy. He must think there's a lot of coin to be made here. Who, if I get my hands on him, I'll... Sorry. Thank you for helping me, Sarah. Honestly, it means a lot. The rascal's name is Menel Dinian. You'll find... I thought a fellow mage would have more respect. Oh, he started out all sweetness, invited me to tea, asked about my business, even bought a copy of my latest book, Tea and Tazan. I am quite highly ranked, too. Surprised? Not every tells on. Alchemy teaches us the hidden potential of everyday things. Turning the ordinary in... <laughs> what? Healers aren't permitted to deal... Alchemy is not nonsense in this game. Very fucking powerful, in fact. But no, I'm a fucking master wizard and a master alchemist. you in here 
I create a great many keys for a great many doors in Suran and beyond. Now, now, there's no need for violence. You're one of those iron hounds. She's not setting me up. Friend, I see Constable Gretka found you. Uh, please, uh, forgive me if I don't stand up. The Marshal's henchmen broke my... one of them. The people of... Ah! Mortal guardian. Good. Truth, That's a good idea. Many warriors have taken up the cowl. I was just the most recent. These knees, though. I fear my heroics are at an end. But to you, of course... No, mate. I can't do it. Don't act so surprised. You've proven to be a capable warrior and a friend to the downtrodden and oppressed. Oh, Vardenfell needs a Scarlet Judge. I can think of no one worthier. A Warden Libo, the prisoner's overseer, took it as a trophy. While they were interrogating me, I heard him mention a, a hunting trip to Lake Narvia. Find Libo and you'll find the judge's regalia. Once you don the cowl, seek out Constable Gritka. Ha! Oh, a doughty and heroic escape. Usually I'd jump at the opportunity, but... No, friend. Dragging a cripple out of here only increases the chance you'll be captured. Your mission is too important. So long as I'm here, Talaran's guard remains down. Be more torture, no doubt. I'm not so foolish as to think I can keep silent forever. But I'm certain I can hold out until you retrieve my regalia and deal with Laren. I am not. To the people of Vardenfell, the Scarlet Judge is legendary. Supernatural. It can appear anywhere at any time, or even many places at once. Ugh. They think it wizardry. Of course, the truth is far simpler. Damn, I can't get this off the bloody brink, man. Exactly. We're a small and diffuse group. When age or injury prove too much for us, we pass on the mantle. The legendary Avona Ulus mentor. Gotcha. She protected the people of Morrowind for over 40 years. We battled together for 12. Uh, 
Sadly, she passed on years ago. Poisoned blade. It was a very dark time. But as she lay there dying, she charged me with protecting the helpless, just as I charge you now. The Scarlet Judge fights on. All right, give me a second. Now we gotta check the body. He was leveled again. One second. Come on, come back, asshole. quick
so that's three. I'm going the wrong way. Nope. Acting goblin.
there's a sight for so eyes. The Scarlet Judge returns. You wear it well. Better than Melar, even. But don't tell him I said that. Shaw's bones, he's a stubborn one. Well, let's make sure he doesn't suffer in vain, eh? Halaran's gotten sloppy since Melar's capture. A combination of paranoia and misguided relief, I guess. She's making mistakes. Now's the time to act. I did some snooping of my own while you were gone. According to Constable Krenn, Halaran ordered Inanius Eggmine sealed today. Bet you a pint that Halaran's meeting with her plantation allies in that mine. The front gates are barred from the inside, but there's an old service door near the back. It just so happens Dradini had a spare key to sell. Sneak in the back of the mine. Side of the town again.
Unacceptable. How could you be so clumsy? With respect, I wasn't the one who left an incriminating note on my dresser, Velocity. This bickering accomplishes nothing. The Scarlet Judge is in prison, yes? The issue is well in hand. You are mistaken. One of my informants told the judge that our interview was just a form. He's not a vampire! What's Stop this? sniveling! They found us! Run! We caught these three trying to slip away. Should have seen their faces. It's a big risk arresting Saran's most powerful landowners. I'm hoping you've got the evidence to make it worthwhile. Where's Marshal Hlaren? Resisted, eh? I had a feeling it might go that way. Hlaren was happy to send other people to prison, but going herself, her, that rattled her knees. It's a shame she won't live to see the inside of a cell, but... These three will, for at least a while. With Hilaren dead, command falls to the senior officer. For now, that's, uh, well, that's me. I'll send constables out to the plantations to liberate the slaves. In the meantime, I've got to take this evidence to House Redoran. Oh, Melar. Well, I took a hard look at the evidence. Far as I can tell, this was just one big misunderstanding. Crane and I released him just before we set out. You'll find him in town nursing his wounds, no doubt. You should speak with him. Greetings, my friend. You cut quite the dashing figure in my old regalia. Another spectacular victory for the Scarlet Judge. Yes, but I do so knowing that the legacy of the Scarlet Judge is in good hands. We Dark Elves are beset on all sides. Ah, look there. The fruits of your labor. Stay in line and keep those mouths shut, sweet sir. I'll throw you in prison without your clothes. It's good to see you alive, my friend. Oh, very good. Indeed. Forgive me for not getting up. Don't take this as an excuse. You're walking again, or else. I suppose it's time to find a new line of... Without the aid of a cane? I doubt it. Then again, I've always been a fast healer. That largely depends on the whims of House Redoran. They have the final say on land disputes. I wouldn't count. I suppose it's time to find it. Even without the use of my legs, I will serve Suran. Given the accusations that will soon come to light about improprieties in our government, 
I suppose you've come for a consultation. You poor thing. Did one of her bizarre herbal cures cause worse pains than it cured? Honestly, I've given some thought to drafting a letter to the Archmage of the Guild. Of course not! Wait, are you another one of these bark-munching herbal apologists? Telenra's teas are not remedies. I'm sure she makes a delicious marinade and some very fine scented lotions for the ladies. None. Now, see here. If she sent you to fish for an apology, she won't get it. I'll not apologize for the truth. Yes, Menaldinian was an insufferable ass. Did he now? <laughs> well, he'll certainly regret that. Oh, come on now. I'm not going to poison him. I'm going to brew a potion that requires precise timing and freshly harvested lichen. The one that grows at the base of the Emperor Parasol. Meet me near Menaldinian's house and we'll put my plan into action. Does not slam pump out of all. Hey, it's very not going to use. you are any luck finding perfect you may have noticed an odor it's subtle barely noticeable in fact but once i add it to this wick wheat and quack surprise he may have squeezed a few secrets out of me but he mm. removed some facts hope you packed a handkerchief you smart bastard what's going on out here Eh? Why, I have half a mind to... Cats? Ah! Achoo! Aww, that's so cute. Oh, this one's got a little red collar. Just 
Did you see the look on his face? No. As much as I'd like to, you know the healer's oath. Do only moderate harm to those who cross you. I brewed a tea that you... Then leave him to his sniffles and blubbering. Patients tend to avoid healers covered in their own snot. He can settle this business with his reputation. Oh, everything. Don't be coy. I know who's responsible for this travesty. I never should have told that scheme. Apologize to a grubby telephony piss peddler. Are you deranged? I shall report her. I shall... Oh, oh what's the use? Fine. So, did we... Oh, thank goodness. Luring cats to his door every day would have gotten awfully tiresome. In the end, he'll see it's for the best. Clap! Lenra, I wish to thank you for that most efficacious tea. And? Impressive results. And? It was rude of me to malign your alchemical practice. I apologize. Can I be mean and forgive you? There's no reason for us to be at odds. We should try to cooperate, yes? Yes! <laughs> Agreed. So, now that we're on good terms, can you please shoo these horrid creatures away from my clinic? Of course. I brew just the thing. Be seeing you, partner. Farewell. And to the next town. You know, I can help clean things up around here. I know how to keep them clean. This isn't a place for going. Everything's fun when you don't have a 
I mean, I'm to the wrong. Why shrine? I don't have to go, you know. Where's the alarm? Here. Yeah. That was a brave deed. Rescuing Sandra. This isn't up to the gate. Keep them going. Kuro, Mako, Rekuta. Damn it. Of... Ah, ah, yes. Hello. What are you doing up in the middle of nowhere? Going for a walk? This one often walks. Around here, I mean. Nervous? Me? Ha! <laughs> Do not make this one laugh. Hollins here is just... just horrible. Bandits kicked this one out of his home and stole his crops. Halindir is just a simple farmer, you see. They will make me a starving pauper. You will help? Oh, bless you. This one planted his crops in a cavern nearby. Zane Sipilu, please, retrieve my notes and poison the water. Without proper irrigation, the plants will... You are a true hero. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I was... I am sorry. This mm. one is a nervous wreck. Hollins, you... Do not worry, Walker. Falora is this one's loyal farmhand. She is not very bright. I could, but this... Oh, uh, she knows too much about... They to go on Moon Sugar for Skirma.
working well, you old cat. To say that you're gone. You haven't changed a bit. Friend, go ahead and speak with him.
Irgendwie kein. I'm gonna get the star shot and then I'm gonna run the game.
moment, please. You made it. Good. We have a great deal to talk about. In a clearing to the southeast. But I can wait. I trust you've seen what Palantir and I were growing in there. Mm -hmm. Moon sugar. In its raw form. It's a crude narcotic. But if you refine it, it becomes something truly odious. Sweet. I had to be sure he could do it. Moon sugar is temperamental. No one's been able to grow it here in Vardenfell. Until Halangir. I need you to take the notes you found to Captain Becker. It's complicated. I was a member of House Redwing's Narcotics Oath Bureau. I... I made some very serious mistakes. If I brought this tip to Captain Beckers, he would ignore me. But he has no reason to distrust you. Please. If you'd ever taken it, you'd know. Skooma is a powerful hallucinogen. Addictive, deadly, and cheap. Lethal overdose of it. I don't know. But it doesn't matter. He's developed a method to grow vast quantities of moon sugar in Vardenfell. That's a dangerous... Hollinger is no... I'd rather not discuss it. You are kind to check up on Halingir, but this one... What? How could she? Why would she do that? Halingir... Skuma? No, no, no. Halingir does not make Skuma. My sister and cousin were both addicts. This one would never... Hey, Halingir has huge appetites. A little sugar in the morning to start the day, a little in the evening to soothe the soul. Moon sugar is a beautiful thing, my friend. The Riddlefar's gift to all Khajiit. Is the pursuit of pleasure really so bad? Halindir is glad you agree. The Not now, citizen. I'm up to my armpits and pop. Harlingier? I thought him a clueless sugar sop. If he's managed to grow moon sugar here in Vardenfell, he's more... Did you need something else? For Lura? That skooma fiend can barely put her trousers on straight, let alone conduct an investigation like this. You must be mistaken. Difficult to say. If I had my way, she'd... By order of the Deputy Governor of Sedanin, which happens to be me, the lighthouse is closed. I need someone without ties to the area to look into a matter for me. It seems the lighthouse is broken into. The flame was extinguished. As a result, a ship crashed. I suspect slavers were involved, which means they had help here in town. I find that unacceptable. Discover who dealt. I need to check in with the overseer. His workers are searching the wreckage, and I want to know what they've... By the time we were alerted and had organized a response, precious moments had been lost. We rescued a few, but mostly we found those who had drowned or were crushed on the rocks. Even so, it was nowhere near the numbers a ship like that carries. It was just a typical sailing ship from the mainland. I suppose it carried the usual complement of cargo and travelers eager to reach our verdant shores. I don't believe that such a vessel would make the trip without filling its holds. Damn slavers. Ever since our agreement with the Pact went into effect, slavery has been outlawed throughout most of Morrowind. But all we did was drive the slavers into the shadows. This whole stinking event has their bloody fingerprints all over it. Here, and in all of the territories controlled by the great houses that support the Ebonheart Pact, 
If you stray into Telvanni or Dre's territory, though, the practice remains strong and vibrant, hence my current trouble. We are just a small outpost along the Bitter Coast, but I like to think of us as the gateway to Vardenfell. From here, the Vex City and the other Inland locations are easily accessible. Governor O'Melian is in charge, although I contribute as necessary. Faldar's tooth when Thalek tried to open a portal to oblivion. allowed up here she asked you to an outlander isn't it enough she stuck me up here to guard the flame indefinitely but now she's looking for help outside the house guard <sighs> what else can I expect after what happened the other night Pindon sent a barrel of his finest ale for watch captain Bethes' birthday Powerful stuff. One cup and we could barely keep our eyes open. The entire regiment was knocked on its collective ass. When I came to my senses, I saw that the fire had gone out. Look, once I heard the crash along the shore, it was all I could do to get moving and raise the alarm. Cherish's water loves to loiter near the lighthouse. Maybe she noticed something. If you're intent on doing your job, you should talk to her. I don't got like an answer to that, but ask. foot coverings are contaminating my pond. So direct you are. It makes my tongue wither and the answers dry up in my mouth. Go and bother someone else with your... No! There's no need to involve the governor's deputy or the house guard. When they start breathing down my neck, my scales shrivel right up. I did notice someone near the lighthouse that night. You keep asking the wrong question. I did not see anyone that night. I felt them. They made ripples in the water. I felt them stuck by the tree that overlooks my pond. Then they moved off towards the lighthouse. Look through the tree, moist one. I prefer my waters to remain still, calm. Crying causes ripples, and ripples lead to more dry questions. Would you be so kind as to talk of gods makes my scales itch? If the living gods really cared, they wouldn't make me... Welcome to our... 
keep it down. We don't want to attract undue attention. But what happened? I thought I was supposed to go to the drop. You didn't come all this way just to give me my reward, did you? Already? Let me see. Oh, it's beautiful. I love working for the tribunal. It's so much better than trying to earn a living as a thief in Vivek City. But where's your helmet? I've never seen an ordinator out of uniform before. Oh, right. We're not supposed to talk about ordinators in the tribunal in such a public place. But it feels good to be doing holy work for a change. And such a simple task, snuffing out the lighthouse flame. I mean, on CV is the ending of words. Alexia, Cecil, Vivek. Unfortunately, the wreck of the vessel provided no additional clues. Were you able to discover anything during your investigation? The young woman who works with the grocer. I doubt the tribunal would ask her to do something so reckless. Do you have any proof other than her word? Hmm, this is disturbing. This parchment feels just like the sheets that Governor Emilian special orders from High Rock. I'm going to need you to acquire another sample from the Governor's office. It's the only way to be certain. And these things on pot. Not if I don't want him to know I suspect that he's working with the slavers or the tribunal, though I still consider that to be some sort of fabrication. No. If I alert him too soon, he'll just cover his tracks. Not the office. He keeps it in his private quarters, accessed through the guardhouse. But I'd never suggest that you sneak into his quarters and steal a blank sheet of his special parchment. That would be against the law. Do you understand me? again so tell me you didn't do anything unlawful now did you that's odd 
We haven't done a search of Fire Moth Island since Governor O'Melian declared that the House Guard was better used patrolling farther up the coast. And these parchment sheets definitely match. This is very disturbing. What I think doesn't matter. We need evidence, but we also need to launch a rescue. Slavery is illegal in Pact territory. It's time to visit Fire Moth Island. Hopefully, somewhere along the way, we'll find more proof of Governor O'Melian's ties to all of this. Attack before the soldiers have been assembled? That's not a prudent course of action. We need to muster our forces, make plans and contingencies, unlock the armor. What was that? That's a distress signal, and it came from Fire Moth Island. No time to prepare. We have to rescue the slavers' prisoners. Soldiers, to the ships. We sail for Fire Moth Island. Oh. last my days i owe you one I can't believe it. Free. I thought I was done for. My associate will be here soon. Patience, Governor. I informed the Governor that the captives we rescued from Fire Moth Island are safe and sound. This note, along with the other evidence you uncovered, clearly implicates the Governor as working with the slavers. Well, I suppose we're done here. I have a silt strider waiting. No. Governor O'Melian, I am placing you under arrest for promoting slavery in Pact territory. How dare you accuse me of such a thing? You have no proof. A note on your parchment, which led to the sabotage of the lighthouse and the shipwreck off our coast. A letter naming you as the slaver captain's partner. Do you deny your involvement? That proves nothing. 
I'll have you hanged for this. With the documents you requested, definitely go. And your report to the Vex City claiming Firemoth Island to be free of slaver activity, written before we eradicated the slaver base. Don't. You can't believe these blatant lies about me. My duty is clear. Traitor. Secure him. Yes, Governor Sir. I hope to bring honor back to the station of governor and... Fellow outsider in this Dreloth Heloran of House Redoran at your service. Though I doubt I'll be very useful here. This is Ashlander country, and they've made I'm researching for my family's ancestral tomb, you see. My research led me here to Aldrin. It's hot unfortunately, yes. I wonder if we might aid each other. Despite my misstep first, pay was you'll see a great bonfire in the middle of part of the ritual, the annual pilgrim. Fathers of the Yes. I discovered a tablet hidden. The tribes gather here. Hmm. Your footsteps are as loud as a Kagudius. Have you now? Then you have my thanks, and my curiosity also. Remarkable. You would honor our ancestors. Very well. I give you my blessing. For Ahemusa, an ashen fern. For Erebeninsum, the weapon of an exile slain by your hand. For Urshilaku, the bones of a guar returned to ash. And for Zainab, the hidden... Yes, though becoming is a clumsy word for it. Every daughter of Veloth has worth. When we learn to speak with our water tongue and read the truth in the stones, we also learn the truth of our... Oh, God. Wow.
Okay.
wild and untamed, isn't that the same thing? That's a friendly. We're not. Fucking worry, I got all the groups. Cool. Hopefully I don't know if I remember the order. I get this in who goes where. Who what's what. Welcome. You stand amidst the circle. Of course. Now, we may team death. Anyone can ever the capture the ring. Ah, one of my persons. 
Welcome. Well then. Halt, Fetcher! I think we should execute. Now get lost, scum. We're not going to use. Still don't believe it, man. You surprise me, outsider. All here assembled say you are both brave and courteous, a hero worthy of praise. Yet, I still sense. I do not know this name, Hilaron, but there is an ancestral tomb nearby. It hides among the rocks to the west, beyond the fire. No, but I have heard that. <laughs> some first-rate diplomacy no surprise there 
Without communion, our ancestors grow agitated. We Dark Elves tend to be prickly in life. We're doubly so in death. I have to know if the tomb belongs to my family, but I'm in no great... Would you? What a relief. Take this sash. Anything that... Damn, I'm as that him. I'm necessarily printing for some other thing. Halt, outsider. You bear our crest, but your blood runs dry as ash. You are no Hleron. If you come as a friend, Prove your intent, pay homage, or join us in death. We were nomads once. It was Saint Veloth's doing. He taught our hearts to wander. In those days, the first. 
first Ash comes, called me brother. We linked arms with the other tribes and hunted the great scar. With my spear, I struck the final blow. All of Belos' children embraced in triumph. Then everything changed. The scar fell. My people cried out for the quiet life, with crops and strong houses. We silenced our Velothi hearts and settled beside the fire river. Scar provided with chitin and meat. We thrived. There was peace for a time, then bloodshed. First Ashkans grew old and died. New Ashkans took their place with souls dark as pitch. They painted their faces and slaughtered us with our home and history lost. The last of the Halerans left the wastes in silence. You have paid your respects and listened, even as my family tries to kill you. I sometimes forget the courage and vigor of the flesh. Years, truly? The Hleron name survives? Then there is hope for our house after all. Yes, tell him that Aldrin was, is, and forever shall be our home. So long as my house, the children of Ash may have forgotten our name. They will not have forgotten that spear.
Back on getting tired. <laughs> back just in time too the ashlanders mood has soured since you set out i'm not sure how much longer i can linger here tell me did you find anything in the tomb is this by the three this is calderas the hilaron spear of myth i've seen illustrations but i never thought i'd hold it in my hands remarkable so my ancestors fought alongside the ashlanders to bring down the great emperor crab unbelievable but yes in the shadow of Scar, we found our home. There are few things more sacred than a dead hero's wish. I will see our home rebuilt, our wise mothers. I apologize for my haste earlier. I was simply desperate to reunite with my ancestors. That spear, I suppose. Where did you come by it? Our mutual friend found it in my family's tomb. It belonged to my ancestor, Dranoth Hlaren. Dranoth? Wise one, isn't that... Yes, the unsung, wiped from our history when he led his kin away from the Velothi path. You know him then? Dranoth battled Scar alongside your people, didn't he? He used this spear to fell the beast. Yes, Dranoth's kin, your kin, were once clan friends. When Dranoth left the path, our Ashkan slaughtered him and his people a sin that still haunts us we rarely speak of it perhaps we can make amends i have no quarrel with the tribes but my ancestors have claim here aldrin was is our home absolutely not the houses claim our land our livelihoods they will not take scar from us as well farsia i have no desire to displace anyone i will welcome the velothi people to my table your pilgrimages, your cans, your celebrations, all will remain as it is. You have my word. The sins of your great houses do not wash away the unsung's claim. The Velothi people honor the past, even when it is inconvenient. Settle here if you wish, son of Dranoth. I only pray that Scar is big enough for both of us. Thank you, wise one. You honor me and my ancestors. I vow to show your people equal respect. I'm going to leave it there. I'm actually getting pretty tired. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, please like and subscribe. If you're watching on Twitch, please consider following. If you're watching on YouTube and you want to check out the Twitch stream live, link will be in the description below. Or you can check me out at twitch.tv slash wednos96. Yeah, I'm actually a little annoyed at myself for being so tired, but oh well, it is what it is. I should be back on tomorrow sometime. I've got to do my shopping and stuff, but... Yeah, once I've done all that, I should be back on, hopefully. But yeah. Until next time, see you later.